Okay, so it's Monday, and a lot of you have been uh, asking me to show you uh, the trades a little bit, or show you the proof that it's working a bit. Well, I just want to show you. I've taken the trades today. This is all my high math, and uh, up uh, end of the day with 7,500. Uh, just trading the NQ and YM today, but uh, it's all about taking the high mathematics. That's what it's all about. That's what it's always been about. It's all about the best math that you can get. That way you experience the least amount of losses, the least amount of drawdown, and you get the most amount of ticks for the least amount of risk that you can get. That's what the best math is. And that's what I've got now. And uh, I'll show it to you again on uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday because I got good math for the whole week. And I've got many different trades. I have many trades today. Today's a good day uh, for the market on Mondays. Uh, good, good math on Mondays. And so uh, you make some very good money on Mondays. And there's a lot more math to be found out there on many different instruments. Really super high math, 90% plus, 90 plus mathematics. So there's a lot to be found. It's not easy to find, but there's a lot to be found out there. And so there's a lot more stuff that uh, can be found. And I'm going to teach in this new course how to find the math so that you could do it yourself on any instrument you want to do it on. This is very, very valuable because you can find your own math that nobody else knows about. And uh, that's very, very, very valuable. Also, uh, after I'm done with this course, I'll come up with like maybe another 20 trades or maybe only 15 trades, depending upon how many I can find, that also have really high math spread throughout the dollar, gold, everything, just spread throughout many different instruments. So, a lot of money to be made at the markets. Anyway, I'll be back tomorrow on Wednesday to show again the math or the conclusion of what happens when you use this math and that your success or your failure for the day but it's always really super successful because the math is so high once occasionally you lose but uh, there's a secret about that you know uh, when you lose you lose uh, in a very short specific time like in one week or in two weeks is when all the losses come so you have to know that and just back off on the trading right then and go right back to trading again and you'll just keep winning again over and over and over again. So there's a way to avoid some of the losses even though you have super high math already. And I will teach that to you in my new course coming up here which I'll be done in about a week or so. Anyway, I will see you tomorrow. I will take uh, more trades. I'm not sure how many trades I have tomorrow. Not that many tomorrow. Today I have the most trades out of the whole week. Today, Monday. But uh, the rest of the week I don't have as many trades. Sometimes only just one trade. That's the best I could do is get one trade for that day. Uh, the best math I could find. I've got lots of math at 70%, even 80%. But trying to get uh, 90% and above is difficult. But once you find it, that's your money maker. So... Anyway, uh, I've got one for tomorrow, one or two, I've got two tomorrow, I think, two tomorrow, and then one on Wednesday, and then I've got two on Thursday, and just one on Friday, so, but anyway, all really super high math, and I'll show it to you for the week. I'll be back tomorrow. Happy trading.